Good morning, it's me, Lulu. Um, today, I'm going to be making um, poached eggs. I don't eat eggs, but my boyfriend does. He loves it, and he is he prefers poached eggs. So, I learned to make it so that he can enjoy it. That's the kind of girlfriend that I am, I guess. Um, so, I have all the ingredients set today, and you're going to go on a journey with me on how I make my poached eggs. All right, enjoy. All right, so <clears throat> we have over here the ingredients that I will be using. Mushrooms, bell pepper, shallots, and a piece of kale. Over here is the egg that I have in the avocado. Um, this is the olive oil that I used. I have the water boiling for the egg, and this is where I'm going to cook the let me turn this on. That's where I'm going to be cooking the all the ingredients. So there you have it, guys. Okie dokes. So the water is at a boil. Usually you let the eggs cook for a good three minutes. Once it's boiling like this, you reduce the heat from hot to low. So I'm going to put it on a four. With the poached eggs, you need something to scoop it up really well. So, not to scoop it up, I'm sorry, to stir it to create um, a nice rotation, a circular motion, so that way it can uh, allow the eggs to really look good. So we're gonna wait for it to stop boiling for a little bit and then we're going to put the egg in there. Um, we're gonna let it sit for three minutes. I'm gonna have my timer that I use with my phone to do that. And let's see here, timer, stopwatch. Okay, I'm gonna set it for three minutes for the eggs. So here it is boiling a little more. I'm gonna wait for it to stop boiling. In the meantime, <clears throat> I'm going to get the veggies ready. First thing I add will be the shallots and let that cook. Okay. <clears throat> kind of mix it up. With this, I try to not let it wait till it gets brown. I like to add all the vegetables with it while it so all the flavor can seal in together. Okay, so now I'm going to add the rest of the vegetables, which will be the good old, I'm gonna put the kale last so it doesn't overcook. But everything else is going in. There you have it. Okay, so now I'm going to add my three ideal um, seasonings. All this cooks here. Let me set this up so you can see the process. Going to add Pepper, salt, garlic, and paprika. All four of these. They're my go-to. Pepper. Just gauge it. Add some salt. Let it fire a bit. Add some garlic powder. Right here. So I, I don't have a, a specific amount of like teaspoon of that I use or measurement that I use. I just gauge it with my eyes and then I mix it all up. Let it 
cook it simmer, letting the heat a little bit. I also like to add a little vegan butter to the mix. I like about it. it doesn't take that long for it to cook I'm gonna move it back a little so you can see the other stuff okay the water is boiling for the poached eggs so I have my timer ready here I'm going to set it for three minutes I'm gonna stir the water like this, creating a vacuum. Then I usually hit the start button and then I take my egg here. And then I pop it in. I check what time I put it in for. And then I just it just spins like this. Whoop. It just spins in a circle to get its shape while this deliciousness cooks and then about now I will probably add the kale because it's pretty much cooked um, so I add some of the kale let it sit for a little bit Where is the... and the timer is going I have about a little over two more minutes left for the crochet I'm going to put in the cow, let it cook a little bit, let the flavor get in there, just for a little bit. And that part of it is done, so I'm going to turn that off. There. Right. Okay. So I'm gonna place it on the um, on the bread that I already toasted down here. I toast it. He likes it really brown, borderline burnt. So, so first I place the. Um, and then I take the veggies and I put it on top like so. Less than a minute left before the poached egg is ready. like this okay and then the eggs is ready so I'm going to remove it it is a little messy now but I'm gonna make it all pretty soon okay it's been three minutes so the egg is in here and it's ready just gonna remove the extra bits on there And I'm going to place it over like so. And I like to um, add some basil to it. So that's what I'll do. Sprinkle the basil to make it all pretty. Because it's all about presentation. And then I like to put paprika. 
on top as well. Okay. And here's the poached egg. I'm gonna wipe the plate off of it. It was very messy to um to hold a to hold a tablet and cook at the same time. So I apologize if it was a little shaky and crazy. But that is the end. Let's see here, make sure. Get it centered. Okay, and that is how I make my poached eggs for my man. Okay, hope you enjoyed it. I hope um, it wasn't too tricky to kind of watch with all the movements going on. But what can you do? What can you do, right? So have a wonderful day, and I hope you try it and enjoy it. Have a good one. Bye.